Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. My name is Buyaka Chan, aka Joe, and uh, before we get into this, I want to I, I want to talk. Out of here. Was that a shot? I don't know if you can see that. I'm gonna sneeze. Nope, it's gone. I want to. <laughs> God damn it! I want to talk real with you guys for a second because the support on my channel at the moment is so un real we now this doesn't seem like a big deal i know you're probably gonna laugh at me but we just hit 30 subscribers now saying that you know i, I sound stupid but you know it's last week we were on 13 so we are growing and if we can keep this growing up before the end of the year we could hit 100 subscribers and that that's that's uh well that'd just be that'd just be amazing wouldn't it but the, enough of the kiss ass talk today we are back with some more commercials now this was uh this was a link in the description it was the top one so i just went with it uh top link in the description for this video will go on to be what i watch next so on and so forth so this is the 90s commercial cringe compilation i haven't watched it i have no idea i think it's made by sir cringe yeah okay sir cringe there you go shout out to sir cringe go no, Go subscribe, why not? Let's let's just Look at this. Come on, look. I'm already smiling. We haven't even watched anything and I'm already laughing. Cool things happen when you start the day with Kellogg's Pop Tarts. So cool. They're hot, so hot. The hot taste of real fruit filling inside. Cool. And cool frosting on the outside. Real hot. The cool hot part of this complete breakfast. So cool. They're hot, so hot. Thank you. Also, before before we go any further, I noticed in the last one I did this a lot. I don't know why that I, I just grabbed my chin, so I'm gonna try and stop that. But let on, I need to go back. I need to watch this again. Hold on. And cool What is that? What is that? Someone decided, you know what? Do you know how we're going to sell these? We're going to stick pot in the pop tarts. That's right. We're going to stick pot in the pot. They're going to break it open. It's going to And they're going to be higher than that for the rest of the day. Genius! I, I should. Look, look, look. There it is again. There it is again. Ready? It, may it comes back again. There it is again. Just instant pot. That's not a real boy. Hold on. Thank you. Hold on. Hi, Trish. What is that? That is ter Is that a that's not a real person? If it is, I'm sorry. I am sorry. If that is a real person, sincere apologies. No, no, okay. <laughs> that is terrifying. If I went to Burger King to order some food and the, the cashier ran out of batteries, I would run away. <laughs> I would I would I wouldn't even pick up my food. I would be gone. That is the most terrifying Oh okay, so it's a battery ad. I'm so confused. I thought it was an ad for a Burger King or something, but no. No, I was right it's a battery ad. Hey, chick Why can they have just use <laughs> I'm thinking about this too much. Why can they just use a TV remote? Does your TV remote always run out of batteries before the big game? Duracell, help you power your TV remote. That simple. <laughs> that simple. What do you do when you're off on drugs? Beat it! Drug free is the way to be. Hold on. I need a minute. I need a minute. Someone's been taking so many drugs that the fox dog thing is talking. 
Just saying, that wouldn't happen. I'm gonna sneeze. I'm not, I am. <coughs> uh, <coughs> <coughs> oh, it's been up my nose. Obviously. <laughs> like the drugs. Drug freeze the way to be. Oh, I'm crying now. Attention Pokemon fans. Get ready for Pokemon Live at the Fox Theater. Now you can be there as all your favorite characters come to life in this on-stage musical adventure. It's the only place to see a brand new Pokemon with amazing powers. You can meet Brock, Misty, Ash, and of course, Pikachu. As the action hits the stage at the Fox Theater. Wanna catch them all? Gotta catch it live. That's not cringe, that's bloody awesome. I would go see that show. Granted, I've never seen Pokemon, but I would go see it. Awesome. <laughs> Why is that in a cringe compilation? I'm done. I'm sorry. Dolls. Hang on, I need to check. I need to check. I need to... Give me a second. I'm going to expose myself. Okay, yeah, we are recording. I just... Needed to check. No, now I've laid it up. Damn it. This can go more wrong if I tried. There we go. I don't like dolls. They're creepy. Especially, have you seen? Right? I have a little sister, okay? And the other day I walked into the limb room and she was watching this YouTube channel and it was just this guy playing with real life looking dolls. Maybe that's what I need to start doing. Dolls. <laughs> Did you see? I almost threw up. That's disgusting. Also, I don't know why your pee is that yellow and that thick. Why is it see-through? I've got the shivers now. Okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> what's this dance? I'm like, Go away! What's what's this dance? <laughs> I don't know why it's so funny. You know what it is. Okay. You <laughs> I can't stop laughing. That was. You know what it is. Alright, let me tell you what. Let me, let, me, let me tell you exactly what that is. That is. You know when. It, like, TV was just. Okay. You're a little kid, you get a toy for Christmas, okay, and you play with it so much, and you do so much with it, and it might be cringy, but you don't care, because it's brand new. TV in the 90. Trust me. If you were a goldfish, you'd swim around a bowl eating soggy fish flakes. You don't like fish flakes tough. You don't get a choice. But you do, because you're a kid, so you can go to Burger King. No mustard, no problem. You don't like choices, be it. What's Burger King got to do with fish flakes? The fish doesn't know that it's missing out on Burger King. It's never had it. All it's ever eaten is fish flakes. Goldfish, you want it your way, you can go to Burger King. Now it's time for the Pizza Head Show. Hey everybody, I'm done trick-or-treating and now I'm gonna go for a stuffed crust pizza at Pizza Hut. Yay! Pizza Head Show. Hey everybody, I'm done trick-or-treating and- Why does it look like my man has got chlamydia? <laughs> Look at that! Look at his eyes. If that was, if I, if that, yeah, I can't say words. If I ordered a Pizza Hut and Mr. Chlamydia turned up, I would send it back quicker than that. I'm not taking. Look at that. Now I'm gonna go for a stuffed crust pizza. Just pizza saying. Hut. Yay! Not yet, Pizza Head. There's one more place to go. Did the pizza just want to go get pizza? Sure there is. Oh, trick or treat! 
Mm, interesting hieroglyphics on this game. Ah! Quick, Pizza Head, let's go upstairs. Hey, hey, who is here anyway? It's your host, Count Steve. Oh, nice place. You gotta go. Ah! I want to go pizza now. The Count will be happy to give you a lift. Hey, See you next time. Ooh. Why did that? That gave me the shivers. My man licked his popsicle when his roof fell in. Big Crikey. For that bigger lick. <laughs> that is not how you start a commercial. Big stick for that bigger lick. Man's <laughs> possessed. The fresh maker. Okay, that shouldn't be in. That was awesome. Did you hear that beat? Hold on. What? <laughs> Hold on. What just happened? They terminator up in this bitch. Liquid cool. New. Why? But why though? With the labels on. Pick a color, pick a face, or a flower, or a place. Make a car, make it cool. Labels on your stuff for school. Yo, 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 put a label on. With the labels on. You know what they say? Label it or lose it. With the Casio labels on, you can label all your stuff in all kinds of fun ways. Oh, sweetie, what do you want for Christmas? I want a label maker. <laughs> this, this, this sucks. And so did that, whatever that was. No one, no, okay, if you if you have a kid and you say, what do you, what do you want for Christmas? And he goes, the label maker, adoption papers. Yo, the same. Available adventure from Cassia. No one's gonna buy that. What's not? What's hot? What's not? What's hot? Instant Quaker oatmeal. What's not? All these cold cereals. What's hot? You are steaming strong, powered up. What's hot? Living hot, playing hot. With this complete breakfast. What's hot? I don't like you hot cereal. <laughs> Man's just trying to talk. I don't. I don't eat breakfast. Okay. Personally, when I wake up. Uh, I'm, I'm, my brain is still trying to, uh, like, okay, you know when you, know you get on a treadmill, you can't just, like, go on and fucking start sprinting because you're going to fall and break your face. you got to go slow. My brain goes slow. It starts slow and it's going to warm up like a motorbike. I can't force food into my stomach when I just wake up. If it's hot, the only thing that should go in your body that's hot in the morning is a cup of tea. Plus, Enough yeah, said. If you didn't have rules, someone would get hurt. Yeah. It's very cool to follow the rules. What'd you get? Here's there you go. Rosie. What'd you get? I got the big bowl pimp. What'd you get? I don't know. <laughs> punked. Man's got punked. <laughs> Again. The kid's short. Okay, I'm just saying, I would be pissed if I walked in, bought a half of me or left, I took out the toy and got hit with slime. Because not only have you just ruined my favourite shirt, but you ruined my burger. Think. Press the word stories. One with every tasty kids club meal you buy. Only at Burger King. Taste rules. There I was with Bunny, mixing up some quick. When magically we were in the laboratory of the mad Dr. Foolish, who was turning the world's chocolate to Brussels sprouts. Say no to drugs, kids. What was in the quick? <laughs> We have to stop him. I'll distract him with some quick. And I'll unplug his machine. Chocolatey quick? Ah, chocolatey quick. Ah, my machine! We sure pulled the plug on this one. <laughs> Katie, lights out already? Almost. 
Oh my mom, I just got drugged by the quick bunny. Check out the cheese in this new ranch dressing. New super cheese ranch. I can't stand ranch. Ranch dressing is the worst. I had it one time, never again. Dressing. What's it taste like, dude? Yeah. And there's taco ranch dressing. Remind you of anything? Arriba. Perfect piece. Almost I know I keep pausing it, like between everyone to say, but what were the what were the producers in the nineties? Like they literally, they must have just come off like a a three day like cocaine bend, okay? And then they were like, yeah, dude, let's let's. I, I don't know why I went Stevo. <laughs> they were like, yo, dude, let's make an advert. And they were like, yeah, dude, sick. Let's make this head kid turn into tacos. Any effort is well worth. Waffles, the part of a good breakfast that's why did he good why did he have a plate? Hey, Lego my ego! Did he say Lego? All that for a waffle. Yo, you wanna play some baseball? I'm just saying. No thanks, I'm gonna chill. Dude, wanna hear some rock and roll tonight? Nah, I'm just gonna hang. Hey man, because I'm high. Some skateboarding at the mall? Nah, I'm... Did he just say do you wanna do some skateboarding at the mall? There's something in my eye again! Why would you go skateboarding at... Like, even the sidewalk is better. And if you your parents won't have a £200 fine when you run over the security guard. I'm not into it. Stay on the street, dude. You thought smoking pot would take you places you'd never been. So how come you're going... Nowhere. Nowhere. I've never seen this ad. Partnership for a drug-free America. That didn't work, did it? <laughs> Come on, let's go. I need breakfast. And don't shut the... My Kellogg's Corn Pops. My keys. They're locked in. Stay calm. Smooth move. Maybe we could call for help. Yeah, sure. Help! I want my Corn Pops. Oh, like sweet popcorn. I could be having them now. But thanks to the little dwee bet, I'm locked out. My pops are locked in. And what am I gonna do? I was gonna do... <laughs> I'm not even gonna comment on that one. I'm just gonna leave it. Yeah. Don't we all? <laughs> hey, like that Kellogg's Rice Krispies treat cereal, huh? Mm-hmm. I bet you can't stop after one bite. Mmm, try me. Uh-oh. Another Uncle Freddy invention. Behold, it's my homemade Resisto helmet. Thinking about marshmallow y <laughs> crispy oh. cluster. Yeah. You win. <laughs> I want more part of this. If my uncle walked into my kitchen with a helmet that had a built-in gag, <laughs> I would ask more than more than the questions that these kids did. You want some rice crisps? No. What? Complete breakfast. One taste. I thought they were selling the helmet gag. I was about to buy it. All I'm gonna say there, that's my new ringtone. <laughs> that was amazing. What they see. Take hidden treasure cereal. Every square looks the same. Sweet, crunchy, right? But certain ones have the taste of fierce, fruity frosty inside. Some got it, some don't. Some blast ya, some won't. How do you know which is which? Research. I'm gonna guess the ones that are bright pink are the ones with the stuff in it. Research. Attention consumers. Certain portable gaming systems are being dressed up in order to distract the buyer from their ordinary one color play. What could be next? Little flower print dresses? Black leather restraining devices? <laughs> Was that Nintendo in a gimp suit? <laughs> I'm not touching that. I'm not touching that on camera. I 
I mean, it would work. You know, if I walked in to buy a Nintendo and it's in lingerie, I would buy it. Like, I wouldn't even question. I'd be like, sold. Maybe not the Game Master. That was a little bit far. <laughs> what was wrong with her face? so confused that wouldn't happen why did she go flying the shark would but I feel like all of these have a little bit of a sexual undertone just say it that's all I'm gonna say Says mega. Woo! I'm not. If you know what I thought it said, keep it to yourself. It said mega. Oh. Okay, that was it. I exposed the fact that I like to watch Dad's Black. Come on, bro. Okay. Okay, that was it. That was reaction number two, guys. If you liked what you see and you want to see more, then please subscribe, like, and comment down below because it shows me that you do actually appreciate what I am doing here and it helps me out a great ton. Now, I love this. This if this series is something that actually takes off on my channel and is pro and is constantly not progressing, but if it like at the moment I'm getting views and if those views stay consistent then I'll keep this up if they drop then I will I will try to get them back up but if, if they drop and they're not coming back up obviously I'm gonna have to switch to something else but I love this series and I will do it again and again and again so if you liked what you see and you want to see more then please hit that subscribe button down below and leave a like because it does actually and I'll see you guys in the next one peace